Hey everybody, what is good? This is your guy Taz with Taz and Philly. It came here to give you what you come here for reactions. Uh, this is a special reaction as due to one of our awesome, awesome fantastics, as we call you. Um, as we call you all who subscribe to us. Um, and this is a PayPal donation request. So this goes out to the awesome David Stiller. So, David Stiller, thank you very, very much for really loving our channel and we're happy that we give you something that you obviously love because you keep coming back uh, so thank you that means we've done our job um you requested this song called pity party which is a cover for melanie martinez um and then we've reacted to up oh, that must be a fantastic contact to me we've reacted to this wonderful wonderful songstress um from Kazakhstan, who's also where Dimash is from, if you know Dimash. Um, so she's going to be singing this rendition, which is a cover for Melanie. Um, haven't heard it before, which is great because it just makes it that much more real and, and raw because I have no idea what to expect. I don't know how this song is sang or anything like that. Uh, we don't pre-watch anything, so that just adds to the excitement. Um, but I haven't been disappointed yet. <clears throat> Hopefully you all won't, but if I do, I'll let you know because we keep it honest here. But um, so, yeah, so we represent music appreciation. We stress it on every episode uh, because we don't know who might be popping in for the first time. As you see here, we've already subscribed to this wonderful songstress's channel, but the song we haven't because I haven't heard it yet. So I'm hitting like this is the gift of free. If you're not able to perhaps purchase their music on Spotify or what have you, Please support them with a gesture of free by subscribing to their channel and liking and commenting because um, it really helps them out and also shows the love. Um, support them first. We always emphasize that, but support us second. So please smash our notifications and subscribe to us and like and comment. Thank you very much. It helps us out. Um, so let's get into this song. I'll commentate more afterwards. Hope you're all having a really good day. Um, you know, it really means a lot. Even if you have to take 20 seconds out of your life to take t 10 seconds to slowly inhale, 10 seconds to slowly outhale. I found out that it really pre creates a moment of calmness to reach your Zen for if you're ever having a moment in time when you're just frantic or going out of your mind and you need to just relax. So um, just wanted to mention that to you. We care here on Taz and Philly. Uh, so yeah, that being said, let's get into this song and I'll commentate a little bit later. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Till my invitations disappear. Out of my heart and heavy curse Let her tell me why the hell no one is here Tell me what to do to make it all feel better Maybe it's a cool joke on me Whatever, whatever Tells me there's way more cake for me Forever It's my party and I cry if I want to Cry if I want to Tell the candles but all this place I couldn't tell my pity parties in flames It's my party and I cry if I want to Cry if I want to I couldn't tell the candles but all this place I couldn't tell my pity parties in flames Maybe if I knew all of them were I wouldn't have a trap inside a soul that holds me Maybe if I guess it all this pal I told them decorations weren't past the ravens Maybe it's a cruel dog on me Whatever, whatever Doesn't mean there's way more cake for me Forever It's my party and I cry if I want to Place. I'm going to tell my pity party 
feels like I'm dying But I'm loving, I'm crying It felt like I'm dying I'm dying I'm dying Ooh, I'm loving till the candles burn out the flames I'm crying till my pity parties in flames Here's my party and I'm crying for one to cry for two I'm going till the candles burn out the flames I'm going till my pity parties I'm letting my cards away early. Like, I just, it's just something about her that I just love so much. I just love her whole commitment to her, to the music. You know, there's people that just sing a song, and then there's people that convey a message and exude a message through their pores when they sing. And she's one of them. Like, you can feel the emotion. The song is called Pity Party. It's about feeling pity for yourself. And you could feel that from her as if she was the one who it was affecting. And that's a good thing, because if you're going to have a message, the message has to reach us, especially virtually is one thing. If like you're at a concert and they're right there in front of you, literally in the audience or what have you. But it's another thing to make people feel it virtually and stuff like that. And she did that. I'm way over here on my laptop. And I felt it. And that is a good thing. Um, what I also like is this is the first time for me I've heard that very familiar saying, it's my party and I'll cry if I want to, in a different light. I've always heard it more like amped up. And I think I heard it a few times and saw it in like some movies that I've seen or musicals or something. I just can't remember what. But this is the first time I've heard it integrated within a song. And it was so saddening. Up, oh, real and authentic people. Um, and I heard it within a song. Um, and I never really paid attention to those words. Like I've heard it, but I never really let it let it resonate until now. So, like when you think about it's my party and I'll cry if I want to. Yes, it's sad that you're crying, but I like the fact that it's like you're taking ownership. Like, like it's almost like saying, Don't tell me not to cry. I'm crying, but I'm crying because I want to, like it says, um, you're not like forcing me to cry or whatever. It's like, I'm taking on, I'm taking ownership. Like the, the tears are coming. I'm taking ownership. I'm going to cry if I want to. I like that sense of, um, resilience in a way, you know, it's like saddening, but it's like, you're owning it. Um, but the whole premise of it all is like, you know, if you now insert here, insert yourself here or anything, um, it's a saddening thing. Like if no one's around, like if you're having like an actual party or a gathering or or just people in general around you and you're expecting them and then nobody shows up and stuff like that. Um, she said at one part, um, the pity party going up in flames. Um, it's a saddening thing. Um if no one comes because for one you definitely feel alone it's magnified and for two it's like wow what goes through your mind does anybody not love you or did they lie to you they say they were coming in or not so and it doesn't even have to necessarily necessarily be a party party it could just be a gathering it could be well let's say you're going let's say it's a wedding and nobody shows up at your wedding or even let's say it's a, a funeral saddening and nobody shows up there it's whenever there's people that are supposed to be coming and they're not coming how does that make you feel inside um which intensifies the emotions so i really love that and i also love i've said this a few times in her videos she, i love how she, the simplicity of it you know it looks like the video costs five cents but that's okay because as long as the message of the song is conveyed, that's all I care about. And that's all I know many of you care about. You don't need the glitz and glam high production videos. I love those too. 
but it's not always necessary as long as the message gets through. So, um, bravo, bravo. Um, yeah, so <laughs> I let my cards away early. This comes to the part of our show. We always do our thumbs up pass if we like a song. Thumbs down ass if we don't. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I'm happy that most of the songs I've been listening to lately I've liked, but that's just luck because we're very real here. So, like, if there's, if there's ever a song, and if you watch our playlist and watch this for a while, there's songs here and there. Up oh, must be a fantastic. There's songs here and there that I don't like, and it's just our opinion. But we keep it very real here and honest here. That's what we pride ourselves on. But luckily, lately, there's the songs I've been listening to have been wonderful. Um, so great. You go with you go and take it how it is. So this uh this is Taz with Taz and Philly. Um, write in the comments how this song made you feel. Um, if you can relate to it, unfortunately, or if you know someone who's been in this situation, um, if it relates to you, hopefully this song heals you and helps you take ownership of some things. Like if you need to let something out and vent, don't regret it. It's, it's very therapeutic for your own body. So take ownership of it like you did. I'll cry if I want to, damn it. So, yeah. So this is Taz with Taz and Philly, and I want you all to take it easy and keep it breezy. <laughs>